to fix the sims 3 you probably know me by um what's it called know me by trying to fix your gta 5 freezing installation and it worked some of you were bitching about how much i talk well nobody's telling you to come over here and uh, watch the damn video bye no one needs you bye i'm trying to help bye anyways um <clears throat> let's see oh my gosh i'm so fat I ate all those candies. Ugh. Anyways. Um, oh, guys, want to see my dead baby? Cute, huh? Anyways. So, now I'm going to help you guys how to fix The Sims 3. Um, You could uninstall everything and reinstall everything like what I'm doing right now. But what I noticed is this is to fix your no disk found or please insert and it will and you know obviously there is a disk and it's right here but it's saying you don't have it. And have you noticed that I put this on? Um I discovered how to fix it on my own and it was really weird. So how to fix it is go to uh, just find your files. Usually you'll see it on applications, The Sims 3, and just copy everything. Just get all that and copy it to your desktop and then try again and it will work. Thank you for watching. Just kidding. I'm not going to leave. I'm going to reinstall this to show you what I mean. Okay. What I did was, it was so weird. Since this is my last installation, I recommend you um, installing the last one to be your one to play. For example... Get this, put it on your desktop, and then it'll load. I think that's a picture. It's not really anything. That's what I think it is. Um, click this. Um, okay. Continue, continue, agree. Um, click, I mean, do your code. You could copy that. Pause it and copy it if you want. This is for the seasons. Um, click that. Make sure you click it. Uh, continue and continue and continue and put my password in and then this thing once it's done loading you will um that's actually going faster than ever <laughs> it never used to go that fast but anyways so after you're done with this you're gonna like I said literally go back over here and get all the information put it on your desktop and then click on the sims 3 and launch it oh i actually did a little mod kind of to take off the launcher so when i click this it automatically goes straight to the game so i cannot play the game i mean i can't see the launcher what i what i what i'm trying to say i'll show you okay uh okay give me a second this is what i did i went to applications Go to the original Sims, The Sims 3, go to The Sims, oh, now it's Supernatural, no, go to The Sims, show package contents, uh, info, plus, whatever it's called. Now, if you go down where it says, um, oh, dang it, what did it say? Uh-oh, it's not here anymore. What the heck? It was just here. I can't get it back. I guess I changed everything, huh? I, I, I deleted um I can't show you anymore dang it what did I um uh, it was here it's not here anymore that's so weird oh here it is here it is here it is you'll see here make sure it says string files I I erase okay this said s3 it did not say t it just said s3 launcher I deleted that just that and then typed in TS3 and then save it and how to save it is you could press file save or just click on that icon and press S and it'll save automatically you could finally take this off and it'll go sh you don't have to do this I'm not telling you to do this because a lot of people on my GTA were freaking out I never told you to do this I said it worked for me it was a method it was just and I found this on my own so Except the deleting the file. I got that online. But the rest, I found out on my own how to do it. I just freaking put everything on my desktop. Because my um, my theory was the computer couldn't really find my files to play the game. So anyways, I'm almost out of time. Okay, uh, let's see if I can do this in 10 seconds. So yeah, pretty much is everything what I just said. Thank you for watching. And you don't have to do what I just did. Uh, the erase the thing. So just click this.
and it will launch without your launcher and if you want your launcher back you have to install some other things on your mods I mean go on mods online and then reinstall it now I feel like a geek because I have I have glasses on and everything I'm just talking anyways <laughs> so I haven't played this game in forever but I started playing it again for just for fun I guess to waste time uh, my projector screens coming soon I'm excited so I could play video games bitches um Let's see. Uh, so any questions, please let me know. If it worked, like, please, and subscribe for more updates and more videos if you like. Um, please comment. Please. Please. I would love to hear your guys' theories what, what's, or how to fix it yourself. Show other people. You know, Share that good karma because we all love you, but I love you more. Um, so what I'm waiting for is this to be done so I can show you what I really mean. So, um, hold on. Okay, so it's done. You don't need to do anything here. Just X that out. Now, what I did was, remember, files. Uh, oh, stop. What am I doing? Uh, go to the Sims. Copy literally everything. Put it on your desktop. Let it load. And it worked. I don't know why it worked, but it worked for me. And you could erase this. I made a little file here to see and to put everything here. I don't know if it's going to work or not, but uh, let's see. Then I went to the Sims and copied literally everything here, too. And that's pretty much it. And X out and then play the game. Now, the launching thing, if you did do what I did, you'll never see the thing again. But you could still see it. On the oh, should I click on Supernatural instead of the? Oh wait, it's working. See how the the launcher did not pop up; it just goes straight to the game. That's what we're gonna do. So, beep 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 beep. beep. Oops, sorry, I didn't mean to flick you all off. <sighs> Same forever. Oh, guys, one more thing: it will take forever depending on what computer you have. Since I have, oh yeah, and if it does take forever, be patient at least. If it, it's more than five minutes, you could turn it off. You see what I mean? People assume, oh, it doesn't work, it's all black, because they don't have patience, but it is working for me, as you can see. Um, it's all about patience, guys, patience. Now, to get your launcher back, just start the game and go to that little icon that was here when you play. Go to options, open launcher. That's how you get your launcher back. So, thank you for watching. Hopefully, this worked. And if it didn't, I'm so sorry. Goodbye. Please subscribe for more updates and videos. So, thank you so much.